Is the red area bigger? Or is the green area bigger? In fact, the areas are exactly the same. And it does not matter where we move the points on the top and the bottom. This will always hold true. How is that possible? Let's see if we can figure out why. Let's shade all of this area blue. Let's try and find the area of the red region plus the blue region. So take a look at this first pink triangle over here. The area, half VH. The area of the entire orange rectangle, BH. So the area of the pink triangle is half the area of the orange rectangle. And same thing is true about this pink triangle. And this pink triangle. And this pink triangle. Each is half of the areas of their corresponding orange rectangles. So in total, all of the pink triangles have area summing to half of the total rectangle. So red plus blue equals half of the total rectangle. Now, let's try finding the sum of the green and the blue areas. Take a look, if we combine them, we form this triangle. This triangle is exactly half of the rectangle. So green plus blue is also half of the rectangle. The red and the blue regions sum to half of the rectangle's area. The green and the blue regions sum to half of the rectangle's area. We set them equal, we get red plus blue equals green plus blue. So red equals green. And we can move around the points and we can see that still red is always equal to green because this proof will always hold true. Wasn't that amazing? If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe.